て。Who are you working on tonight? Ah, I decided I'm just gonna four of them. Four. Yeah. So I'm gonna drop it down to one for right now. Uh, Hello, everyone. Uh, well, not I guess technically not everyone because nobody's in this room. I'm on my way. Me too. Phone numbers, my contacts. I don't think I'd be able to see you straight. You can't see straight anyway. I won't be able to see <laughs> even straighter with if I had names, and names and addresses and everything. My contacts. <clears throat> oh, okay, man. That was. I don't have I don't have my headphones set up, and that it's got a commercial, so it's. Taco Bell. Oh. Taco Bell commercial, so. Uh, I am going to be kind of in and out for the first few minutes. Go on. Uh, Get out of here. For the first little bit of the game. Not that it's going to matter anyway, because my freaking internet's unstable again. Oh, uh, that's not good. Yeah. is all big it almost looks like I'm doing the splits on his back what'd you do that for I don't care how many oh, colleges they built or how uh, much the sea swallows up well noise. kind of I'll, I'll blast them why'd you do that cause I could oh okay alright that logic checks out honestly <laughs> back it's a shire. I suppose it would be inappropriate the guy didn't get mad at me a for taking it so I was like okay fine oh. I'll take it I expected n I understand. I'll take that now, as a, let me take yeah, a good look as at this. Over thank here. you? We haven't much time for discussion. Yeah, I saved his life. But what did you need? Of course you look dirty. Hmm. This is intriguing, but highly disturbing. It appears that <laughs> of course you look dirty. About Mercer hmm. Intriguing, to the guild but highly months. disturbing. Gallus had begun to uncover <laughs> what he calls an unduly lavish okay, lifestyle replete uh, with theory, spending sorry, theory, vast sorry. amounts of say, gold, yeah, the conversation yeah. I, can, I can have between Does you and characters in Skyrim is kind of yes, entertaining. Gallus seems certain that Mercer had been removing funds from the guild's right, treasury well, without Enter's talking. knowledge. Actually, I'm going to pause this, so I will be right back. I could also still cooking dinner, so Give me a sec. Be right back.
Wow, look at that. My PlayStation free didn't freeze, and my uh, anything else, and, and my bitrate actually increased, so my internet signal got a little bit better. <laughs> yes, here it is. So, the last few I will have to run back to out here in probably less than ten minutes. Go into great detail. So, Gallus also repeatedly mentions his strong belief that Mercer desecrated something known as the Twilight Sepulchre. Shadows preserve us. So it's true. I, I'm not familiar with the Twilight Sepulcher. What is it? What, what's Mercer Frey done? I'm sorry, Anther. I can't say. All that matters is we deliver your translation to the Guild immediately. Farewell, Anther. Words can't express. It's all right, Carlia. You don't have to say a word. Hmm? What do you think you're doing? I was trying to pick it up. I'm sorry, Anther. Listen, all I want is the truth to be revealed to the guild. They respected Carlia, and she deserves better. Come, if you have further need you can go to the college. Guide my hand. Really? I accidentally stole a basket. Another attacking you. Okay, I went upstairs and I lost him. Ah, uh, that's hilarious. Those fools are actually fighting! <laughs> Alright, you've had enough. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? I'm with the guild. How about you look the other way? 556 gold. Or... You caught me, I'll pay off my bounty. Um, I if I do this, I'm gonna lose my uh. Everything here appears to be in order. Yeah. You can move along now. So I had to bribe him so I didn't lose my freaking crossbow. All I if you ever manage to gain entry to the, I've been known to handle items of questionable interest from time to time, and I'll see what I can do. We must hasten to Riften before Mercy can do any more. You You've come this far. So I see no harm in concealing it any longer. The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to Nocturnal. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their Everything that represents Nocturnal. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath with Nocturnal. I felt the same way when Gallus... I think given time you'll understand what I mean. As a Nightingale, I know the Guild doesn't do much to foster... I'll make for Riften. In the meantime, I wanted... If the Guild isn't willing Was to listen to reason... Else? You might have to. All right, so I want to do some more looking for Dead Corn Rock. We'll do later. Proud Spire. We'll do later. Understone Keep and Markarth. Just got it, actually. Give me a second to. Cross that one off. And I dropped my controller. You're not supposed to play with fire, you know. Kid? You know what? Since we're here and we gotta I'd do just about anything one quest for the the college to get one of these things, why not? Let's uh, make a right. There we go. Cross the bridge at your own peril. The way is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom, and if, in the process, my present... The more important question is, why are you here? Perhaps, but what is it you expect to find within? 
I desire to bend the will of those around yes, me. Yes, the School of Illusion can be quite influential. Kings have re- It would seem that the college has- Not just anyone is- A small test, if you will. No, I'm afraid I don't know anything of the sort. Excellent. The fear spell has saved the life of many an illusion mage. If you could cast it on- I look forward to it. A weasel has appeared. Offer, eh? Good. Much knowledge lies within the college's walls. If you can pass the test, then yes. Oh wait. I had that one. Yeah. It's been a pleasure. No matter what. I'll uh, cost 129 to cast the fierce spell. Well, guess I'm putting a point at a frickin' magic. I don't want to put a point into illusion. College uh, Okay, um... Alright, be right back one more time.
Okay. Now, let's see. Do I have anything that'll help me with increasing Magicka a little bit? Um, level up? I did. This way. Let's see. Over here to Dawnstar. See if there might be a little something in the the chest over here. Oh, and I am permanently back now. Excuse my Pepsi. something I need to do a little bit off screen grind up some enchanting and some other stuff frost you know what let's get some of this stuff anyway <laughs> God, I can do that now. Okay, going back up here by Cork Bowl Group. Uh, take one. Great, I'm gonna come out to come out of this and be paralyzed, ain't I? <laughs> Stop paralyzed. Look at that tail still twitching. Fortify marksman. What the heck? Do do I need to start making a bunch of stuff with corkball brute too? Cast the fear spell now. Yes, just barely. Oh, not Snowdale. Winterhold, there we go. Like, where'd the college go? You haven't discovered it yet. Technically, I, technically I have, but officially I haven't. The 
psychologist. Well done indeed. I think you'll be a superb addition well to the Well done indeed. When in, in her mind, she's thinking it's about time. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabelle Irvin, our master wizard. I believe I've made myself rather clear. Pretty sure people don't want to watch me talk to me about many again and stuff. Your concerns are not on after the uh, the one with uh, welcome, after welcome. Sujin. Uh, we were just beginning. Please stay and listen. So, as I was saying, the first thing to understand is that magic is by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Sir, I think we all it's understand me. that fairly well. I'm I'm we magic. Be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, volatile, my dear, of course. dangerous. You also can and will some destroy you. Natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control, mastery of magic. It takes decades <coughs> of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. I what was about to curse him do? out. Well, your classmates certainly seem to disagree with you. Oh, don't listen to him. We can do it. Just give us a chance. All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a war. So I want to and try to talk you can uh, Candy into maybe doing spells, another game. Right? If, we, if we can Would get in, anybody interested. Are you at all familiar? Yeah. And I want to see if we can get the fairy race in into that's it. That's all right. I can teach you a very basic war. Okay. One that's enough for the purposes of this lesson. Um, now, if you'll just this is going to sound really there, weird. I, I want to make a, a fairy and you block it with the fighter. War. Here we go. Over there, please. Just okay. Um, fairy rune knight fighter. Now, cast the ward spell. Damn. And keep it okay. Up. And you're squishy. You have to keep your ward up, or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. I was keeping my ward up. Over you didn't there, do please. your freaking job. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Uh, no, here's the thing. Um, you know, at level five, a rune knight, like a fairy rune knight fighter, can basically grow big enough to suplex a Tarask. Now, cast the Damn. ward spell, okay. and what you learn here will last. Excellent yeah. Uh, well, at I level five, the rune knight stuff. gets a giant. Well, like I think it's a giant's might. It's no secret right? that the college's right? reputation in which Skyrim lets is you grow. Uh, it says in the description it says if you are smaller than large. In the ruins of nearby. It's oh no! This is at, no, this is third level. This is I when you first get your your uh, and see what uh inside. your That's subclass. Thank you. So it says if you are larger or if you are smaller than large size, you can immediately use this as a bonus action to immediately grow to the the size large. Well, let's put it this way: large is the equivalent of an ogre, right? <coughs> okay. Then fairies at 5th level, they gain the ability, uh, or they have an ability, uh, fairy magic, which at different levels you get different spells. Well, at 5th level spell, you get, you just get 
in large reduce. Right? Yeah. So, bonus action. Giant's Might. Grow to size large. Regular action. Cast Enlarge on myself, which makes you go up two sizes. So you go from small to large with Giant's Might, right? Yeah. Then, Enlarge Reduce, go up two size levels from extra large to gargantuan which is the uh, the the size of Taras or an ancient dragon yep let's put it this way imagine if Pike in uh, Vox Machina had the enlarge or even Keyleth had the enlarge reduce spell and cast yeah. enlarge on Grog no Grog smash. Yeah, everything. Yeah. Grog will have stuff up. Yeah. So that's why I'm, you know, basically, and they have a 30 foot fly speed. So. <laughs> You know, a, a, a fairy the size of the terrasque just flying around. Yeah. And how long does that enlarge go last? I know you. Uh, enlarge, reduce, I'm not sure how long it lasts. The, uh, the giant's might is for a minute, at least. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah, considering a uh, round of combat is six, six seconds. Yep. Yeah. So I'm like, I, I kind of want to try that in an actual setting because <laughs> it seems like it would be hilarious. Kind of OP. But yeah, just don't get hit. <laughs> well, no, I guess as a fair, you'd have kind of a higher AC though too because you're. Oops. I thought that was a mage. It was not. Um. Oops. I thought he was a mage that was going to be up there and going to attack me, so I just, I'm like, you know what, I'm going to sneak up on this mage, hit him first, and then when it gave me the kill cam and it zoomed in on him, I'm like, uh-oh, <laughs> oops. Here we are. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe, but it's always better to be cautious. Requires key, and then before Tolfter can come over here and open the door. I still get to open the door first. 
I find it hard to believe this excavation was approved. As some oh. of you may know, Sawthall was one of the earliest Nord settlements of Skyrim. It was also the largest. Move, students, get out the way! Backed by the elves and the infamous Knight of Tears. I gotta wait for them to get down here, so... Yeah, go help Arniel. Yeah. Go pick up your rings. So we got they all have the same enchantment. Yeah. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such an old. Well, are there any questions before we begin? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any any enchant. Now let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Brilliant, my dear. Why don't you search for All right, where are you at, Arniel? Anything designed to keep people out. You know, Arniel does for fun. Let's go to the gym and get them gains. What it's up? going to take forever to. He what? You must be one of the new apprentices then. Fine. fine. Not one of these just, days you're going to get sucked into a just dagger. Just don't make a mess. I've only looked through a portion of this section. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damp. Be careful. Just round up the rest of the magical artifacts so that I can catalog them. Yeah, but then all right. you can summon them whenever you want. He's actually one of the better wizard companions. Better than Jazargo? You shut your mouth. <laughs> what in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? You gotta spring me. I'm never gonna survive in the big in the big house. How I'm gonna come out like Dominic Mysterio. That? Really? Perhaps the amulet is important now, somehow. Now, do you spend one night in juvie? Uh, basically, let's yeah, see. I uh, use the amulet. Where's the amulet? Come here, amulet of Sarthal. Or Sarthal amulet. There we go. See that? Some kind. You and the wall. What's odd is you can't use telekinesis on that right amulet. You can't pick Jesus. up this. You can't pick up the amulet with the telekinesis. Nope. Not when it's on the wall anyway. You can drop and pick it up. Uh. Tolfdir, when I turned 16, Why you didn't even get me. Are you got all my friends are driving around in brand new Mercedes, and you got me a BMW, and it wasn't even an M series. I'm not sure what to expect yeah. here. Please be on your guard. Hold, mage, and listen well. Know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Oh, I guess he's technically not really Judgment there, is Judgment will he? be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. The Order is watching? I... What just happened? You perverts. I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? The Sigic Order? And danger ahead? The Sigics have... Perhaps we should... Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? Get 
guess it's all clear now. Get one of my bolts back, jeez. Be prepared to defend yourself. Be prepared to defend yourself. Nobody's got any of my bolts to give back. Oh, there's one. Okay, never mind. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. This is simply fascinating. Open says me. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about looting all of these. Maybe just a few. Wow, one shot at some drug or death lords from sneak attack. Nice. Ah, uh, two shot at him. Archery up to 80.
bows do twice as much damage. Okay. So real quick, let's see this. Right now, 121 for the Daedric crossbow. I thought they said twice as much damage. Still, 135, not bad. And I can still increase it uh, through blacksmithing, through enchanting, all that fun stuff, so. Alright, so that's whale. Okay. <laughs> in the butt. I thought it high time I caught up with you. Be prepared to defend yourself. imagined we'd find something like this. Why is this buried so far within Sarthol? This is simply fascinating. Take care. All right, Steven. Welcome back. Hey, can we want to miss anything? No, we just got in here to the, uh, the, the eye. Yes, you go after him. Do not lead him back up here to me. Nothing seems to work. He's not yet. Keep it busy. I'll try to drain some of its power. It doesn't even go after him. Jeez. There. Now attack it. Ha! It's your magic got that I am. That I don't, huh? Seeing, am I? Why, 
This is utterly unique. What could this place be? I have no idea. This is amazing. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you right, return to college and inform Savo Saran of this discovery? Please, hurry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta to talk to the Archmage. Get whatever he's got in his uh, Archmage quarters. Ice, ice for me. What are you doing in here? Yeah, go back in there. Get back in there. You said you were gonna watch that. <clears throat> Follow me. Crazy old man. <laughs> to teach you a lesson. There you are. Anyone else? <laughs> All right, apparently they sent one hired thug after me. That's cool. That's only you can afford. You hired that one thug for 206 gold. And I dropped him with one crossbow bolt. Um, I should bring this 206 gold back to Calixto. And be like, you know what? Try harder next time. <laughs> but it is Calixto, so. Just thinking, I'm, like, I'm gonna get here, and there's gonna be some more thugs just waiting for me at the college. Should be hilarious. A bunch of hired thugs show up at the college to see what all the majors Nerf do. Does a fine job as ah. Okay, so I'm about to get the college. Yeah, so just pre-crossing that one off. You know, while I'm here, might as well. <laughs> I was gonna say, doesn't he have a safe in here? <laughs> okay, cool. Not worried about that one anymore. Okay, um, out of the ones I've got left, what do you think? Uh, work on getting Proud Spire Manor, or should I go to Den C Dead Crone Rock, Renovix Bast, or Ingvild? Bill Ingvild. Uh, let's go to Renovix Bast. That's an easy one. Alrighty, let's see.
let's see, that is kind of south of Morthal, right? Yeah. Let's see. South of Morthal, but... Probably a bad idea for me to load into a giant's camp, but I'm kind of an idiot. Made the crab break dance. Another crab, I don't know what happened to it though. the one with the, there's that mage and or that one mage or necromancer or whatever and with the cage downstairs right mm -hmm. okay there's a ghost outside of this Who are you gonna call? This is what I want. Ghostbusters! I don't want to attack you. I don't have any choice. I'm sorry. Love how they're always like, I don't want to hurt you. Don't worry, don't think it's going to be a problem.
this one always confuses the crap out of me because I know there's a way to get out and go up to that dragon wall. I can never remember how to do it. Go over the sides instead of down the middle. to the dragon wall from the, just the outside instead of going up or instead of going inside you just go no you go inside and you're looking at the chest you don't go you go through the raised section to get to the wall I don't have any choice I'm sorry! Who the hell? Why did that ghost have 128 gold on him? That's a good question. So you got the regular chest right there, which I know that's a trap door. I always go with the right side. Yep. So. This way? The red word wall? No, it's behind you. No, I got the word wall already. Oh, okay. So you said. For oh, the easiest way is just to fall down the trap. Well, to get to what's his name? Yeah. After I get back from what's his name, you know I'm fine. Just... Wee! Oh yes, yeah! You've fallen for my trap. Greed makes a great lure. Ah! <laughs> oh, that's funny. It's too far away from me now. Oh well. Journal, take that. Right, dagger. Sweet, okay. That's the good stuff, right? there you just have to go back up and out right yep sorry this isn't what i want So 
the okay, so I'm looking at the word while you said go right, right? Don't know what that one, I have no idea. Ladies and gentlemen, random hits fast. Yeah, even if you're able to sneak by all the. Notice once you killed that guy down there, they're still subjugated, which is makes no sense. Yeah, I know. Okay. Yeah, so if you look on the, the map, it's not the map, I... Yeah, that might be the one with Croesus, right? Hmm. Okay, random fix fast. Done. And uh, next we've got Ingvold. Crossfire Manor, or Ingvold. Um, Ingvold is kind of a odd one. Because if you kill the guy at the end, uh, sometimes when Ether tells you to go out your staff, he sends you there and you can't get it because the guy's dead. Uh, I'm not really worried about Ether right now. <laughs> well, okay. Yeah, I'm not going to be going, with this guy, not going to be going through uh, the Mage's Guild or the, the College or anything, so... Where is Bill Ingveld? Oh, an island east of Dawnstar. Neat. Okay, cool. Well, let's go to Dawnstar. Oh, it's this. Is it this big island right there? Yep, it's that big island right there. Okay, yep. cool. It's a big island right there. Sweet. I should probably sell a few things or something, shouldn't I? Because I'm getting a little. Over overcumbered. Over yeah. I'm getting fat. <laughs> Eating bread, getting all fat and sassy. After my last legendary animal. Ooh, which one is it? The legendary panther. Wait, nine. Wait for like ten hours. Yeah, before I really get started in the main quest line, I want to get to a certain spot with the Dark Brotherhood and to a certain spot with the Dawn Guard. Okay. God, I'm so. Looking to protect yourself or deal some damage?
Okay, I think that's good for right we now. We forge every day if you need anything. How are we looking? Four forty-eight out of five seventy-five. You know what? We're gonna run home real quick. <laughs> We haven't talked to Feindall in a minute, so we can see how much cash we got. So, Vanessa wanted me to stop and get, like, one of those little Encore things, like with the six Salisbury steaks and whatnot. And I also bought myself a frozen pizza, and now I kind of want to know what would it Divine taste like if I friend. put uh, Salisbury steak on my frozen pizza. <laughs> Very good, sir. Ooh, mm -hmm. 9,000. Now we could switch over uh, all of the crops since we don't have to worry about getting our, our alchemy up. pick that up holy crap that's what's keeping me way up there on weight <laughs> yeah jeez I don't have a ring. There we go. Look at that. Now we got a... A ring that bumps our uh, bows up at an extra 19%. We're going to wait. 213. Yeah, why not? Let's... Get those. Oh, i got a few books I can put up.
Okay. Up. I get three more spots on this one. One, two, three. That should be it. Right? Cool. All right, let's continue. Off to Ingvild. Actually, so after Ingvild, I've got Proud Spire Manor and Dead Crone Rock, and that is it. Nice. So I got, yeah, one. What are you missing for Proud Spire Two, Manor? Uh, I got to do the just the quest to get through there. That's all. Okay. And then I can, I've got the money to buy it. It's not a problem. I just got to get the quest done for it. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. A little bit of an echo. Echo. I don't hear it. Oh, my phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I don't hear it. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> so the courts denied Hannah my request of no child support. Yes, in the state of Utah, you can't do that. Wow. Yeah. Even if you both request it? Yeah. If we're both in agreement to it. Because <clears throat> apparently I'm up to something fishy. <clears throat> so, uh, the lawyer, her lawyer, said it would be 750 a month. Which is a bad. I paid 400 a month for one child with my first marriage. Oh, that was a lot of jack. Whew. You're gonna get jacked up. Oh, yep. Yeah. But she said my lawyer's gonna call you tomorrow and see if we can negotiate something on it. Yeah, that's fine. I didn't tell her, but I mean, if we can get it down to 500 a month, that'd be fine. Because I'm already taking them Monday, Thursdays, and Saturdays to feed them. Tuesdays I take them to the park and sometimes feed them. And if we go out to a restaurant, I pay for half the meal. So that's going to stop. If they want to go out and eat, I'm just going to say I'm sorry, I can't afford to go out and eat. Can I get an invite? Or are you in your solo? Dave? I'm I'm in story mode. Story mode? Okay. Jason's on Skyrim. Yeah, I knew he was on Skyrim. <laughs> I'm just going after my last legendary animal. Story mode trying to get all my challenges finished. Again. And again and again and again. Yeah, I'm going to have another save. I haven't played in a while. And this is more of my, I guess, evil character. I have never collected all of these before, so. 
first time for everything. You ever cut all the stones? No. Okay. It's not the most annoying mission. I remember you asking me what I thought would be the most annoying mission. This one or the uh, Crimson Nurn Roof? Yeah. And to me, Crimson Nurn Roof. Nah, <laughs> In the arm! Fatality. No, that's actually the Draugr's weak point is the elbow, right? Um, okay. Unlike regular humans whose weak point is the elbow. Alright, let's get out of Valentine. This is this is a dangerous city right now. Here's DS. Usually, kind of dangerous in Valentine. Valentine and Sandini are the two the two most dangerous cities. Okay, so that's actually kind of fun to think about. Um, Lee, Daedric Crossbow doing 150, right? Times three. Right? 450, yeah, okay. Yeah, so doing like 450 damage plus whatever uh, for the bolt, which I don't know if the... I don't know if the bolt is times three as well, but... I don't think it is. I think it's just... I don't know. That's that depends the question. Because it never tells you what the damage is. Yeah, it just says, like, you know, sneak attack, you know, three times damage. Or, like, times three damage, right? I would think that it would be a combination of everything. Yeah, that, but that's just my thought. So if that's the case, it would be 150 plus 14, so 164 times 3. Alright, 164 times 3, right now. down. Oh. I'll go down and then if that seems wrong then I'll turn around and go back up. Alright, we'll try. Chest on there. Seems like kind of an okay way to go.
Oh. Ow. Yeah. I don't think you're hurt. Wow, those things are hitting me that hard? Okay. Journal number three. Into the throne room. Into the thick of it. I'm going to take out the dude in the middle first. I guess I could have just... Yeah, I just take out both of them. If you take out the... soldier to his right, the, all the girls attack him. What attacks him? All the girls. Oh, what girls? Uh, girls that you've been killing. Oh. The ghost, the apparition. <laughs> yeah, you've been collecting his journals. I got three of them. Oh, there's number four. No, that's not number four. No, no number four is over by the stone. Where is the stone? Um, where are you at right now? Ah, uh, behind you. Or behind him, anyway. Oh, uh, left side. Other side. I'm kind of behind, so I'm not sure where you are. Not that way. There you go. Right there. Wait, go on! Stop! What? Did you skip all mines and you already got it already? No! You don't want to go down this way. Go I started that going bedroom. that way and you told me yes, that way. Yeah, remember, remember, I'm behind you. I cannot look at your stream and be right where you are. You want that room. Getting attacked by a panther. Twenty-two out of twenty-four. So now I just need dead crone rock and proud spur. Yep, proud spur. Bone spur. You got to go to Bone Spur Manor. It's really bad on your feet. Okay, now can I go this way? Ah! 
Oh, these must be the ladies he had trapped, huh? A uh, couple of them. That was the way out. Should I go talk to Paul Firebeard? Yeah, let's go to Falk. Go talk to Falk. That almost came out wrong. Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> um, yes, make, let's go talk to Falk. Yes. Make me have to put on the freaking uh, mature content filter or warning. Yeah. Slip of the tongues, people. Slip of the tongues. Apparently, when I sold them a perfect panther pelt, it didn't count. Why not? That's what I want to know. As hard as they are to get, let's go find another one. But this time it didn't load. Just give me a good panther pelt. But I need a perfect panther pelt. Perfect panther pelt. Yep, perfect <laughs> panther pelt. Well, what are you? A perfect Not panther a... pelt. Oh, just another <laughs> Do you have business with the... You mean the Dragon Bridge issue? Pelt. There have been reports weapons. of we. I don't think it's worth our time with the war going on. But if you want to clear out the cave, well, technically I do I'm have a sure perfect Panther pelt, for your work. but it's a legendary Panther pelt, so it doesn't count as a perfect Panther pelt. Well, I have no idea how many more times I'm going to say perfect Panther pelt. As many times as you need to say perfect panther pelt. Yep. So I'll give me a perfect panther pelt. <laughs> That's going to be the rest of this stream, isn't it? <laughs> no. Pink panther pelt. A perfect, oh, a perfect pink, pink panther, panther pelt. <laughs> hey, want to play tag? No. Precious. Precious perfect <laughs> pink panther pelt? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Peter pays for a, <laughs> for a precious, panther. yeah, for a <laughs> precious scene. perfect pink panther. Pelt. Hello and well, bows and We're arrows for the dots. mighty huntsman. <laughs> Is that a cheetah? <laughs> oh, Ooh. Dave, look what I spotted, I panther. Very nice. How much is it? Oh, 40. Oh, 4,000. It's like 40,000. Damn. And it was <laughs> so illegal, I can read. So 
Yeah, I'm getting that. Uh... Well, if we spend money on that, you could also go. No, well, never mind. You're good. I already spent. I will money track on it, but... that by comment. No, because in order you can make your your Daedric one legal too. Uh, you have to sell it to a pheasant to buy it back, but uh, that's just not worth it with as long as your speeches. Really, horse, you have to go right there on the Perhaps sidewalk. You can't wait until I moved you back over here. Sorry, people, I'll let you guys step in that. I'm busy. Of course, I know I'm probably going to need dragon bones, right? Or so. <sighs> Not started the main quest yet, so I can't get dragon bones yet. The winking skiva's got warm beds and cold meat. You look like you could use more. Do you think? Do you uh, know the muffin man? I I don't think I know the muffin man, but. Do you think uh, Gollum come to sell me some? Enough I give special to rates to members those. of the Thieves Guild. Show me what you've got. He's got four thousand gold. Really? Only eight hundred and nine for this? Well, pause it. Save it. Do that and see how much he wants to charge you to get it back. Oh, I need those for my other man. I need those for Su Jin. <laughs> Hold on. You know what? Just I'm remember just me if quick. you get your hands on it. Anything else? <laughs> Like he's got an overbite. <laughs> I got I do magic. <laughs> Seems there's always. Being old's not so bad. Daughter it keeps me fed. You guys got quiet all of a sudden, Jesus. I'm looking to see what kind of things I could buy from the trapper after giving all my legendaries. The answer is not a lot, because I still need to go get a lot more pelts, apparently. A lot more perfect panther pelts. Uh, no, not a lot of perfect panther pelts, just a lot of perfect pelts. Perfect what it, beaver pelts, what it, any perfect sheep pelts, any perfect pig pelts. Perfect pig pelts? Yeah, perfect pig pelts. Perfect what if, cow pelts. What if you got perfect Peppa Pig pel pelts? Yeah, that I couldn't yeah, even say that one right. Perfect Peppa perfect Pig Peppa pelts. Pig. Yep. <laughs> oh, we're at it. We dropped off the... Uh, 
Meridius Beacon. Oh, yeah, look at that. Perfect Pether Pelt right there. Along with a perfect Cougar Pelt. Two perfect Cougar Pelts. Lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, Ruin. their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Restore to me my beacon, that I might guide you toward your Two things I need to do off screen. Enchanting speech craft or it is time Enchanting for my craft splendor and, to return like, to Skyrim. But the token of my truth lies buried in the ruins of my once great temple. Now tainted by a profane darkness you tell me what steering within. Is that it right there? Can you sit me down right there? The Necromancer Malkarin defiles my shrine. Worse still, he uses the power stored within my own token to fuel his foul deeds. I have brought you here, mortal, to be my champion. You will enter my temple, retrieve my artifact, and destroy the Defiler. Of course you will. Go now. The artifact Malkarin has forced the door shut. But this is my temple, and it responds to my decree. It responds to my decree. I will send down a ray of light. Guide this light through my temple, and its doors oh, will open. Okay. I think it's time for me to head to bed. Alrighty, well, you have a good night. You too. I'm going to keep you on my phone. Jeez. We will talk to you all later. What the? Oh, that got bright. Yeah. Get the uh, the two enchantments I want for this. I want to get uh, fiery soul trap, which I think I have already. But then I also want to put chaos on it, so it's a guaranteed fire. Might be guaranteed, or might be fire and uh, Other than all that fun stuff, Ron, how's your day been? It was okay. Uh, stayed the night at the house last night because Hannah had to go work. Okay. <clears throat> so, pretty much spent all day with the kids. Took Garrick to school and then took Asley to school. And then after school, took all three to go get haircuts. They look good. All three look good.
bunch of beard hair that gets up under my headphones. Uh -huh. Makes my ears freaking itchy. And then Hannah said that she had to do a show and asked if I could take the kids for a couple hours. I guess I will. Take as much time as I can get. Uh huh. See if I can do this. <laughs> the way Dave was saying is, you know, just fire a few arrows at the top of this thing, you'll be good. kind of fun. by the tracker.
Let's, uh... <clears throat> yeah, why not? We'll keep working out. Locked it with his wrist. Size, that's good. Size what? Five animal, car five animal carcasses sold. Yep. Uh, fish do not count. So if you're doing your fishing mission and want to sell the fish, it won't count. Okay. Found that out last night. You little wizards are adorable. I believe with uh, archery enchantments, the highest you can get with the actual enchantments is about 40% on a piece. Uh, what I'm trying to do after I get all these, um, even before I go after the skeleton key, I think, uh, I'm going to cheese it and get 55% an extra 15% bonus damage to archery. <laughs> I think what I'm gonna do for some nights is 
Maybe we'll do some DoorDash deliveries. Earn a little bit extra money. Yeah, since so hopefully, hopefully I could talk him down to five hundred. Hopefully, yeah. Um, remind me again. What do you What do you do? What? Like your job? What do you do again? I work for Dell as a. Uh, our title is analyst, but it's also called resource development manager or deployment manager. We just schedule remote code upgrades for businesses. Okay. Um, to get their servers coded up, right. upgraded to the newest and latest code. My favorite customer, I don't deal with them anymore because I got approved as a federal scheduler. So I, I deal with a lot of federal accounts, military bases and stuff. Okay. Yeah. You for time. My favorite Good. was the Put parent company himself. of... Please. Rockstar. You've done a larger oh, service cool. to the realm than you could I helped, possibly. Uh, I helped get their servers upgraded for when Red Dead 2 started. I shudder at the thought. Oh, wow. So, uh, <laughs> that was fun. Talking to them while they were developing the game, getting their servers updated for the game. Nice. But I haven't been able to talk to them since because, I mean, I want to talk to them and go, Hey, you guys dropped the ball. <laughs> <laughs> This is such a good game, and you guys just stopped. <laughs> There's something personal. Falk told me what you did for us at Wolf's Yeah, I was Cove. just thinking, I'm like, if, uh, you're depending on what you trust. did for a living, like, As you uh, may know, tell when we buried my husband, skills, I would like you to take skills, an item of his. Like a war horn handed down from his father. Yeah, so I gotta go in and take my, uh, me. it's called an ISM. It's information, storage, mm -hmm. um... I can't remember what the M is. Management. Information storage management. Ugh, I gotta take the class again. I took it last summer. I was actually going to college for this. If I sh sharpen my, you know, stop drinking and stuff, I could probably get my ecclesiastical endorsement again. Okay. <laughs> but I could go take the quiz. And then I can move up in the company and be a technical support engineer, the one that actually does the code upgrade, reading the log files and everything. All right. Now, the re reason I, I was asking, I was talking to somebody else today. They're looking for, like, you know, because they're, yeah, they're a parent, uh, a streamer on here. But they also have, like, you know, small kids and... Right now she's a stay -up. kind of a stay at home mom and she's wonder wondering she's like if there's any kind of stuff that she could do from home uh, oh, lots of stuff. to earn some extra money. Mm -hmm. So, um like with her she was you know, she's like, Yeah, I've done a yeah, I do a little bit of like singing and stuff. Uh, Is there a butcher in Ansberg? Okay. Turn around. I know he's singing. Um, so, like, does, you know, a little bit of stuff like that. Um, she said something she wanted to do is, uh, like, a YouTube channel. Uh, or she does, like, you know, she does, like, children's books. So what I told her, I'm like, go to acx.com. Uh, ACX's parent company is Amazon, but what they specialize in is audiobooks. Uh, you can go pick books that fit your voice type and uh, just read books and get paid for them. It's something I actually want to get started on. I need to get signed up for ACX. My only problem is sometimes they can actually be uh, really picky with their um, I don't know what am I trying to say? Like their um, like with your uh, your your home setup and stuff. Mm -hmm. They can they can be really picky with like you know your home studio and your sound quality and stuff like that. But 
Um, so now it's something I was actually looking into is just signing up for ACX.com and doing audiobooks. Another thing, uh, based on what kind of skills you might have, I dude, go to Fiverr.com or Upwork.com and just see what they got. Yeah, if I could get on with this other company, I screwed the pooch last year. Stentor. This job, I think part of it was just because of their benefits. I like the benefits at Dell. Uh huh. But they were gonna start me off at fifty or fifty-five thousand a year. All right. The Imperials are good for business and business But uh, the second interview inspired. came and I just, I didn't go forward with it because my friends that got me interviewed for it, they started off at 65 a, a year. It's a fine day with you around. Okay. Falk said and I think I it's because they you. had their, not degrees, but they had these the certificates that I'm going after. You. Okay. So I didn't take that into consideration. I was just like, 65, that'd be nice. And then when they interviewed me, they offered me 50 to start. And I'm just like, ugh. I'd want more than 50. Splendid. Right now I'm making available. 50. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. So I'd probably be making at least 55, if not more now, if I would have went with it. Yeah. But the the benefits of Dell, I've got three weeks of PTO, I've got two weeks of sick time. Medical is pretty good, dental is pretty good. Got all these great benefits, it's just sometimes money might be better. <laughs> yeah. well, bulk actually, uh, the benefit benefits are nice. Uh, yeah, I think benefits are nice, but also uh, the money. Because that's the thing, is like right now, like, you know, trying to pay for health insurance out of pocket is ridiculous. Yeah. I did it for two years. I got tired of it. I was glad that Dell hired me on full time. They first hired me on as a contractor. Okay. So we had to go get our own health insurance. Uh, see, that's the thing, though, is uh, right now with. Uh, health insurance basically what you need is uh, just something part time to bring in a little extra money yeah so I was thinking that's probably why I'll do DoorDash every once in a while since right. I leave the house at 9pm I don't need a game every single night it's fun <laughs> but I don't need to game every single night And then Saturdays I could do it in the morning or early afternoon before I go see the kids. Yeah. Alright, if I call my wagon away, it'll keep all the carcasses, right? Yes, it will. Okay. I need to get somewhere where there's a butcher and I don't want to drive the wagon all the way down to St. Denis from Ansburg. But yeah, just over here. Don't <clears throat> do some DoorDash every few nights. I'll probably still chat with you guys on the mobile chat. Yeah. So, uh, no, like I said, uh, look into, like I said, like uh, Fiverr and Upwork. Based on it, yeah. you know, certain skills that you got. I mean, they're freelance sites. Uh, I know certain things there for like um, voiceover, and there are some voiceover people that make really good money off of it. But uh, it's not something that I want to do. Uh, just for voice for voiceover uh, for specific reasons. But yeah, you you can get on there and do certain things and make decent money. Especially once you start growing your um, growing your profile. Your ancestors wouldn't love mm -hmm. this, Silas. 
And here comes my first so, visit. Uh, once you start getting the more museum and more, of the mythic uh, dawn is open, friend. And you start off at like you know on Fiverr, of course, you're gonna start off with like you know, uh, basically what you're doing. You can go look at you know profiles for free and. Uh, Yes. What you Mike, do is uh, why don't you, you go come look in. and see what you can browse the displays you know, and we can talk. Out of the skill sets you I have, have a job you look perfect uh, for. Anything from proofreading to you know, you know, writing essays or let's talk in uh, stuff like that. Your loss. You can start at like five dollars and then I'll be here. Uh, based on extras that you have, it's like okay for voiceover. It's like okay, uh, x amount of words or x amount of like minutes. Uh, starts at five dollars. Feel right? free to look around if you want. Come talk to me you know, when you're ready to then discuss. Then it's like an extra dollar per, you know, the tapestries hung here or and outside were found in hideouts for ten words or where members like of the that. mythic dawn If you meet need revisions for whatever, the cult's greatest uh, that's accomplishment five dollars was the assassination of the script Septim Dynasty. Reading, that's another and the like five or ten dollars stuff like Did that. Did you have any questions um, about the museum? So the extras oh, would you rather talk get you the money? Mm-hmm. And uh, you know, once you get enough, you know, some people will just be like, hey, uh, I won't charge you for, for these. Just give me a five-star rating. Kind of like Uber, stuff like that. Right? A little history first. Oh. Um, After the Oblivion Crisis, and once you a start getting enough five-star ratings, dedicated your, to wiping your out the remnants of the mythic dog. You'll start getting more people. One of these groups found work. Maroon's rape. Uh, that was almost 150 uh, years ago. One and the pieces that, are still being you know, kept by the descendants job, of that group. Or, not his right last here, job, but one of his previous Skyrim. jobs on At least Fiverr, two of them. Here are my voiceover. notes about them. I I'll he gladly made a pay you for getting the pieces any way you can. No questions asked. Nice. Yeah. So. Good luck finding the fragments. Yeah. So based on what you what you can do, you can go on Fiverr.com or Upwork.com. Um. Get the get those things. So, if you're interested, like I said, you know, check it out. You can, you know, there's, you know, there's paid, you know, people looking for everything. You know, artists, uh, you know, like I said, there's proofreading, there's, you know, script reading, there's, you know, let's see real quick. So, like, you know, you get different categories. So, graphics and design, digital marketing, um, writing and translation, video and animation, music and audio, programming, uh, yeah, programming and tech, photography, businesses, AI service. So, you know, like you say you did, like, programming and tech stuff, right? Website design, website maintenance, business websites. There's what this stuff, mis just miscellaneous. So, there's a lot of stuff that to choose from. And if you got you know certain skills that you could market, I mean, there you go. Yeah, and it's stuff that you wouldn't have to be going and you know racking up gas mileage and you know racking up the mileage on your car, right? True. It's all stuff you can do at home. But I know with uh, working at Mixed Times, you know, all that driving, you know, especially knowing the the, the fun issues you've been having with your uh, your car lately. With that car. Yeah. Dude, yeah. So all that extra mileage on it, not great. I think if uh, if Dave wanted to let me see something real quick, hold on. Uh, yeah, writing and translation, right? So you could go in here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, blog post. Trans there 
yeah, there's translation jobs in here. So Dave could go through, find uh, certain things that, let's see. Level two seller, this person, I will provide a flawless English to French translation. So translating stuff, English to French. Um, 500 words for $5, one day delivery, you know, free, uh, say, I think proof, you know, one revision, one day delivery, proofreading, document for, uh, formatting. But yeah, like, you know, she needs, you know, if you want, that's the basic or she's got premium $50. Includes 5,000 words, four day delivery, one revision, proofreading, document reading. So 50 bucks for, uh, you know, for translating 5,000 words. Not bad. Yeah. If, uh, <clears throat> if it wasn't for what I'm trying to get into for voiceover, this is actually a route I was thinking about going, is doing stuff on Fiverr and Upwork. Do Fiverr, mm -hmm. Upwork, ACX. And, and it's pretty much, you know, you know, the people will reach out to you. You can be like, yeah, I can do this for you. Or you can be like, sorry, I'm, you know, a little swamped right now. I can't. You know, but and once you start getting that to the like higher sell seller levels, then you can start charging more money. So I want to look. I want to see if they've got uh, anything like beta testers. Save just in case. Oh, fast travel away, see see what that does. <laughs> That got really jumpy there for a little bit. I don't know what was going on with that. Um, now I know like uh, with Fiverr there was, uh, I know stories of like this one mom who did voiceover on Fiverr, right? Part time. You know, stay at home, or yeah, stay at home mom, or no, geez, not even a stay at home mom. 
uh, had a job, and then uh, she would do voiceover at nights after like 10 o'clock when she put her kids to bed, increased her mm-hmm. yearly earnings by about 40000 Nice. So... Last stone. Sneak up to 79. Okay with that. start uh as telling people or like i was telling the stream earlier uh i had to run to the store pick up a few things uh ran into you know newer member of my ward at church and uh just got talking to him for a little bit kind of lost track of time <laughs> so. happened he's a good dude though Okay, I've checked inside. I'm going to check outside. Checking for Did you guys do a Joel mission yesterday? No, we didn't. Huh. We just got a couple basic ones done. Store stamina, damage stamina, rabbit shells with this stuff.
No, it must, have, it must have been that Ravager that's here. Upstairs? How do I get upstairs? Thirty-two gold on her. Violet Snowdrop. Where's that at? Bad spider. Poor Wallace. Alright, where's Fort Wallace? Do you know where Fort Wallace is?
if I'm correct. It says Amber Reno. This station. Clock is station. Yeah, that's just a little ways outside of Valentine. I'll be right back. Alrighty. up here to our last stone of Baron's Eye. I need to get up here and there's this hag raven up here that I need to shoot.
cool. We got all of the stones of Baron Zayas. So. First things first, quick save. Don't have to do that again. Let's go speak to Vex. turn this in and then uh, next time we get on weird why can I not get in there oh I still got to do this part of the freaking mission. okay come on we'll go get this part started finish up a handful of things and next time we get on here with Zoo Gigs, we're going to do some uh, Dark Brotherhood stuff. Sound fun? I think it sounds fun. We're going to cheese the system a little bit, which, uh, again, I think is very fun. Um, do a little bit of uh, off-screen grinding, some... Uh, Smithing, enchanting, speech. We're gonna do that. Good look around. I'm sure you'll find what I'm glad you're here. Are you ready to face the guild? Keep your eyes open. I'm not sure what to expect when we enter the system. Be glad to repair it. Take a look. Welcome back. I'm back. See, I don't think I'm going to be able to finish this task daily. Until next time. Even if you're one of us, you better not make trouble. Vex is ready to tear you apart. I hope you have a good excuse for bringing... Vex is ready to tear me apart. You better have a damn good reason to be here with that murderer. Please. Lower your weapon so we can speak. I have proof that you've all been misled. No tricks, Carlyle. I'll be able to you know, turn out my horses to seven. Now what's this so-called proof you speak ah, of? Ah, okay. I have yeah, Dallas's journal. Minutes, so. I think you'll find its contents disturbing. Let me see. No, it can't be. This can't be true. I've known Mercer too long. It's true, Brynjolf. And we fell off Every a cliff. Yay! Mercer's been stealing from the guild for years. We can talk about that on There's only one way to find out if what the lass says is true. Delvin, I'll need you to open the vault. Wait just a blessed moment, Bryn. What's in that right, book? I'm going to pour some of your horse. 
It says Mercer's been stealing from a boat for years. I fell off the horse and I got trampled to death also. Jeez, well, I got six out of the seven done. Yeah, no worries. No. I've used my key, but the vault's still locked up tight out of the drop. Now use yours. Get in here, all of you. Hate to say we told you so there, Brynjolf, but we told you so. The gold, it's yours. It's all good. All right, let's see. Okay. Okay. Son of a bitch. I'll kill him. Enemies. Vex, put it away, right now. We can't afford to lose our heads. We need to calm down and focus. Do what he says, Vex. Oh, it's an adorable right little there. orcish dagger, Vex. Oh, we do it your way. For now. Delvin, Vex, watch the flagon. If you see Mercer, come tell me right away. Need to stay focused in case Frey comes First one back. done. Make it fast. Unbelievable. You must be the first person to set eyes on all 24 of them and... Well, the last two eras. Now is it worth something? When I told you the set had to be complete, I left out a small detail. I honestly didn't think you'd ever get this far. If the stones were remounted on the crown, it would be of great benefit to the Thieves' Guild. Not exactly. The crown is what the Guild calls a paragon, an object that enhances our thieving abilities. At least that's what I'm told it does. There hasn't been a paragon in this Guild for hundreds of years. I have it on good authority that the crown is within Tolvald's cave, dropped by a Dunmer caravan leaving Morrowind long ago. If you could bring it back, we could restore the- If we want to stay on top in Skyrim, the guild needs that paragon back. Without it, we're just a bunch of petty thieves. Cool. Hey, where do you think you're going? We have work to do. Talk to- No, well, first I'm gonna to talk to Brynjol. Or not Brynjol. Uh, Delvin. Back here, Delvin. Looking for work. Well, well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other on you, what a delightful find. This should cover it. Well, well. I was looking for this yeah. little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, it's worth quite a bit, actually. Quite a catch. Erica assures me, best of all, the guild are gonna tell you s When you walk through the guild, don't be ashamed to hold your head high. You need to stay focused in case Frey comes back. Make it fast. Right, might as well talk to Rinyal real quick. Look, before I help you track Mercer down, I need to know what you learned. I... I feared that... Anything else? What? Oh, that Is there anything dear. else she told you? Trying Jumps to make Mercer look hot spring. Is there anything maybe. else? Then I have an important... I need you to break into Mercer's home. Aye. He never stays there. Just pay... Be careful. Just find a way in. Get the information and leave. And you have permission to kill anyone that stands in your way. Now, almost three hours into this one. Or into this stream. Uh, started a little bit late, so that's why I didn't go the full three. Um, but yeah, it is 1 a.m. my time, so I need dinner and sleep. It's a, it's been a weird day, so. But thank you everybody for stopping by, Ron, Dave. Of course, pleasure mm -hmm. as always. Uh, I will be joining you guys tomorrow with, you know, doing some Red Dead. So, yeah, there's that. 
uh, tomorrow and Thursday. We're still waiting to hear back uh, to see what's going on with Cody's uh, schedule. Uh, if it stays kind of weird and he has Tuesdays off or Wednesdays off, I might change the streams up to uh, instead of Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, just do Tuesday and Friday. So, uh, Sounds good. Yeah. So uh, hopefully everybody can make it tomorrow, uh, Tuesday and Thursday. Again, going to be Red Dad Friday. Back to some WWE My Rise stuff. Um, unless anybody is interested in seeing like the uh, uh, the John Cena showcase. That's the word I was looking for. Showcase. Uh, if anybody's interested in seeing the showcase, uh, I could start into that. Otherwise, I'm going to be doing some more My Rise. Also, if anybody watches this and. Uh, is watching or watches like a replay or on YouTube and you play WW2K22, drop your creator tag in the comments so I can go download a uh, character, so I can go download you and use it in universe mode. Uh, so, let me see, do I have anybody fun to play tonight? Double check. Yes, we're going to go over to Twilight Rhapsody real quick. So, uh, as we get ready to start this little raid ski, uh, I am going to wish everybody a great night. I'm going to remind everybody to keep chin up and remember to relax. And God be with you till we meet again. Peace. Peace.